Hi, so I thought I'd give you kind of an idea of how my GUI is set up for my prosthetic hand uh, project. So this is the main home screen. Um, and then say if you wanted to go into the grip mode to where you'd have individual control of uh, which fingers are locked or unlocked, then you hit the menu button that puts you in grip mode. And then with each, oops, let's go back to grip mode. So there's grip mode. And then with each one of the uh, myo amplifiers, you would either lock or unlock the index, middle, ring, um, and then the palm. Anytime one of them is activated, signal high, then it would be the inverse signal, or it would be the inverse graphic. So, you know, it would be um, the, say for instance, the eye would be black, but the background would be white to show that it was in active mode. And then from there, then we go to accessories. So right now this is showing for the flashlight and then that'd be for your uh, Wi-Fi and then um, Bluetooth. Because I've, I've come up with a little smart, uh, it's a smart relay switch that, you know, you'd be able to say like plug in a grinder or some other hand tool to where uh, you'd lock the hand down into a into a grip position, you know, to where you really have a hold of the thing. And then by uh, giving, say, a closed input with the uh, with the myo amplifier that's on the palm side on the pinky, like you would be grasping something, then it would turn the device on. And then when you uh, no longer give it that input, then it would, uh, you know, then it would turn off. So on the settings mode, which is the next mode, you can adjust the threshold on the Mayo. This is the Mayo um, interface. And then so you can adjust each one of the thresholds without having to hook it up to a computer. You can adjust the thresholds for each one. Say, if, you know, on, it's on a day that, you know, say maybe you're sweating more. So, you know, you have a higher conductivity um, and the device is giving you a lot of false positives then you can just go into this settings mode and then set a higher threshold to where, um, you know, it isn't giving these false positives. So, and then, you know, you, um, then the same thing for, um, you know, Bluetooth and Wi-Fi on, on this settings. But that, that's where I would be using the gyro to, you know, say if you roll your wrist down, then it would go a page down, which would be for like Bluetooth or or the flashlight or Wi-Fi. And then page up uh, would be, you know, a, you know, uh, the opposite roll, you know, a, a, a roll to the left as opposed to the roll to the right, you know, roll to the, you know, roll towards you would be page up and then roll away from you would be page down. And then from there, then it just goes back to the uh, the home page. So, you know, this is how I have it set up in the ESP32. Thanks for watching.